Welcome back to the garage, the place where we are turning your classic car and your dream classic car. If this is your first time here, I'd love to have you subscribe. Putting out how-to videos for the weekend mechanic, talking all the EFI tech for the classic car community. All right, so today what we're talking about is my Bluetooth stopped connecting on my Edelbrock ProFlow 4, uh, so we're gonna troubleshoot it a little bit. So this is the tablet that comes with the Edelbrock Pro Flow 4. And when you get this uh, with the system, it already comes loaded with the Edelbrock tuner and it comes already paired with, with your ProFlow. And all you have to do is click this little guy and usually this would connect to my ProFlow. Now it says make sure the key's on. So we'll turn the key on. So now, E-Tuner cannot connect, we'll retry. And it's thinking, it's thinking. That ding is not that it connected. The ding is that I have Wi-Fi signal. So yeah, so it just sits here and spins. So it's not connecting. And so I checked Edelbrock and they actually have a video about this. And I'll put a little card to the video uh, where you can check it out. But obviously this isn't working um, and it's not connecting. So what Edelbrock has said to do is to actually delete the app and re-download it. So we're gonna take it, we're gonna take the app, take it over here and throw it away. Do you wanna uninstall this app? Okay, we do. Uninstall finished. That sounds right. Play Store. Play Store. There we go. So you got to sign in with a username and password in order to do it. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in. And then once you have your information put in, it is going to verify it. Now I just use my Gmail address. It'll make you do some of this stuff, except Google Play. It's gonna know all your information. And yes, I did bust my screen already. Okay, so now we're gonna finish our search. There it is, Edelbrock E-Tuner 4. So there it is, the Edelbrock E-Tuner 4. So we just wanna click that for it to re-download and gives you all the other options because it's trying to sell you on all that good stuff. So we're just gonna click on the eTuner 4 and then we'll click up here to the install app. And then, oh, review your account before installing apps on Google Play. And part of that is adding a credit or debit, debit card, but you can, down here, you can skip, because we're buying a free app, like, so you aren't really buying anything, but, so it's gonna let you skip it, and then, big bucks, no whammies, install. There we go, waiting for download. All right, now, once you have your app re-downloaded, you're gonna open the app and allow Edelbrock to access photos, videos, I don't really care. All right, so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna to go to pairing settings. All right, so now with the Edelbrock ProFlow 4 uh, keyed on, hit ECU search, and now it's gonna find your ECU. So now the number, the password that it's asking for is the number 000748, whatever yours is right there. Now the important thing is here, you only have 10 seconds to enter that. So you gotta be really quick. See how it already went away? So you have to be quick with it. 
Let's see if I can do it while holding the camera. Zero, 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 four, seven, was that it? Four, seven, eight, wrong. All right, I put it in wrong. Let's try it again. Zero, 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 four, seven, eight. Here we go, zero, 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 four, seven, eight. So yours is gonna be whatever uh, your SN number is, your serial number. Hmm, zero, 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 four, seven, eight, done. Okay. Well, zero, 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 seven, four, eight. <laughs> now pay attention to your numbers because otherwise you're an idiot like me. There we go. Let's try this. Let's try the right one. Zero, 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 seven, four, eight. Done. Okay. Huh? Huh? Well, let's try it again. Scanning zero 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 seven four eight. Press OK to connect. And now it is connected. Gauge displays. There we go. I am back. So I am reconnected with my ECU just like that. Hopefully this helps some of you guys. Let me know if you have any questions. Leave it in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.